guys, welcome back to Click Academics. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to solve this exponential equation. So we have x to the power of x to the power of 4 equals 64. So now what I'm first going to do is I'm going to take the power of 4 on both sides. So now we have x to the power of x to the power of 4 to the power of 4 is equal to 64 to the power of 4. So now if if I have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n, right? And a to the power of m times n is also equal to a to the power of n times m, meaning I could rewrite this as a to the power of n to the power of m. So right here, as you see, we have x to the power of x plus 4 to the power of 4. Think of x to the power of 4 as m and 4 as n. I could actually switch the places of these two, meaning I could rewrite this as x to the power of 4 to the power of x to the power of 4. And this is equal to, now I'm going to rewrite 64 as 8 squared. So now we have 8 squared to the power of 4. Now remember, if we have eight, something in the form a to the power of n, m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n meaning a to the power of 2 to the power of 4 is equal to a to the power of 2 times 4, which is 8 to the power of 8. So if we have something in the form a to the power of a, is equal to b to the power of b. And then this also means that a is equal to b. And as you can see right here, we have x to the power of 4 to the power of x to the power of 4 equals a to the power of 8. This means that x to the power of 4 is equal to 8. So now to cancel this power out, I'm actually going to take the root of 4 on both sides. So now these two cancel out, and I'm left with x is equal to positive or negative square root of, sorry, not square root, root 4 of 8. And this can also be written as 8 to the power of 1 fourths. And this can also be written as 2 to the power of 3 to the power of 1 fourth. And remember, we multiply m with n, so this is equal to 2 to the power of three-fourths. So this is our answer.